guys, in this video, Tunisian hooks set. As I told you, I bought something new in America and why did I buy it? Because I subscribe to Very Pink Knits and a lovely lady talks about knitting, crocheting, yarn and all those things that um, I like. In one of her videos, she was doing a giveaway and um, well, I entered and I sent loads of hopes and lucky charms, whatever, and um, I didn't win, but I figured out that I'll try to find a way to buy stuff and get it over here, and I did. <laughs> oh, they're beautiful. They really are. They're beautiful colors and there are different sizes and I hope the photo will show you what they are. If not, I'll write down them over here. I'll write down them over here. Let's take the pink one. They're so smooth. They really are. Um, oh yeah, really nice. Well, to be honest, I can't say much about it because I've never used Tunisian, I think that's you say, Tunisian. Tunisian hooks. Uh, I did a bit of crochet, but you know, basic stuff, and I never posted anything. Although, you can see that I made some toys and stuff, and maybe I put links over here or over there. Yeah. You can also see the basic technique and a free pattern for a blanket. So I may do that. I would definitely go in to do that. So yeah, I need to come up with uh, with the yarn and with the needle. Well, sorry, hooks. Just let you know, they're coming in as some plastic baggy thingy. My uh, official expression. So it's not only about the size, but also color. And thicker, probably I'll use it too. With the thinner ones, <laughs> like, look at this. This is, um, Three and a half. Such a tiny little little angel. I'm going to tell you what kind of colors we have over here. We have a really dark uh, green. We have kind of purpley dark color. Then we have black, um, red, light green, darker pink. And I would say that that's dark navy. This is kind of blue but with a mixture of of something. Do, 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 do. Definitely good for blankets for something more solid and it doesn't have to be so soft I think. So any covers. Well I'm thinking to basically the first thing I want to do is to take the pattern, maybe not fully the pattern but the, the technique that was used in the video and make um, like a bag for books. I like to read, so I like to take a book with me and I don't have a cover for books. So I figured out that I can knit, well, crochet one with different texture. I hope you enjoyed this quick video and hope to see you next time. Definitely it's something new in regards crocheting for me. So stay in touch and see how it's, how I'm going to manage. Well, I hope everything is going to be okay. Bye. Okay, I got three of these. It's a kind of grey, but like there is a gradient in it, like a little bit shadows, shadowy things.